We're celebrating the 81st anniversary of the Quit India movement and what happened here was politics erupted because in a new reinvented wheel, Prime Minister Modi gave out a war cry of Quit India. And this, remember, at a time with regard to escalating already showdown between the India Opposition Alliance and the NDA. Taking a jibe at the India Alliance, Prime Minister Modi said, Corruption quit India. Appeasement quit India. Dynasty should quit India. Firing fresh salt was in return at Prime Minister Modi for this new video. Mamata Banerjee, the Bengal Chief Minister, said BJP must quit India instead of for doing nothing on Manipur. Congress leader also slammed the BJP in a scathing attack, Jairam Ramesh said. And I quote the Congress leader here. Those silent on Manipur must quit India. Those silent on Adani must quit India. Samajwadi Party Chief Akhilesh Yadav also jumped in and, and conducted a press conference on Wednesday and said that same like Britishers, the BJP will be removed as well. So quit India, while is of course been a very popular slogan of the freedom fighters ahead of 1947, but for now it has also become the big, big political 2023 slogan. Sathyo. सात तारीख के एक दिन बाद 9 अगस्त आ रही है 9 अगस्त वो तारीख है जब ऐतिहासिक फिट इंडिया मूवमेंट की शुरुआत हुई थी महात्मा गांधी ने मंत्र दिया था और फिट इंडिया मूवमेंट ने स्वतंत्रता की तरफ भारत के कदमों में नई ऊर्जा पैदा कर दी थी इसी से प्रेरित होकर आज पूरा देश हर बुराई के लिए कह रहा है फिट इंडिया चारों तरफ एक ही गुंज है करप्शन फिट इंडिया यानी भ्रष्टाचार इंडिया छोड़ो डायनेस्टी फिट इंडिया यानी परिवारवाद इंडिया छोड़ो अपीजमेंट ट्वीट इंडिया यानी तुष्टिकरण इंडिया छोड़ो इंडिया नंबर वन पोलिटिकल रिपोर्टर डिफाइन वॉट सीम्स टू बी हैपनिंग बेटेटा पॉलिटिक्स कोई दूध के से दुला हुआ नहीं है अनमैच आई अनमैच एक्सपीरियंस द वर्ल्ड इज चेंज My black hair has become grey as well. And with unmatched passion for the story. Do not monopolize the conversation. When it's hundred percent news that matters, it's news today with Rajdeep Sardesai, Monday to Friday, 9 p.m. Only on India Today TV.